टुडे आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट अल्टरनेट ऑक्लूशन मेथड ऑफ बाइनोकुलर बैलेंसिंग इन दिस टेक्निक ऑफ बाइनोकुलर बैलेंसिंग ईच आई इज ऑक्लूडेड अल्टरनेटिवली एंड एड प्लस जीरो पॉइंट टू फाइव डायप्टर इन द क्लियर आई अंटिल बोथ आईज इमेज बिकम इक्वाली ब्लार्ड स्टेप्स ऑफ अल्टरनेट ऑक्लूशन मेथड आर वन प्लेसिंग मोनोकुलर एक्सेप्टेंस इन ट्रायल फ्रेम टू फोगिंग आईज बाइनोकुलरली थ्री मेकिंग बोथ आई इमेजेस इक्वली ब्लर फोर डिफोगिंग आईज बाइनोकुलरली फाइव राइटिंग फाइनल प्रेसक्रिप्शन नाउ लेट सी वॉट आर द प्री रिक्विजिट्स ऑफ द टेस्ट रिफ्रेक्टिव स्टेटस मोनोकुलर एक्सेप्टेंस शुड बी प्लेस इन ट्रायल फ्रेम रूम कंडीशन डे लाइट कंडीशन टेस्ट टारगेट स्नेल विजुअल इक्विटी चार्ट टेस्ट डिस्टेंस सिक्स मीटर और थ्री मीटर रूम विथ मिरर trial box in the trial box we will be needed trial lenses trial frame and occluder now procedure of the test let's take an example for understanding purpose monocular acceptance in right eye minus 3 and in left eye minus 2.75 now step 1 placing monocular acceptance patient is asked to sit comfortably and fixate the distance snell visual equity chart patient is requested to wear the trial frame now monocular acceptance is placed in the trial frame step 2 binocular fogging binocular fogging is done in plus 0.25 diopter steps until 6 by 6 letters are blurred but 6 by 9 letter are easily readable suppose with plus 1 diopter patient is saying that 6 by 6 line is blurred and 6 by 9 line is readable step 3 making both eye images equally blur now alternate occlusion is performed by occluding the right eye first then removing occluder to left eye and then keep repeating this patient is asked right eye image is clearer or left eye image is clearer plus 0.25 diopter spherical is added to the clearer image until both eye images are equally blurred suppose patient is saying that right eye image is clearer we will add plus 0.25 diopter in right eye patient is saying that right eye image is still clearer so we will add another plus 0.25 diopter now patient is saying that both eye images are equally blurred Now step 4 binocular defogging binocularly fogging power is reduced in plus 0.25 diopter steps until the 6 by 6 line becomes readable suppose after removing plus 0.25 diopter binocularly patient is saying that 6 by 6 line is still not readable so again we will reduce plus 0.25 diopter now patient is saying that 6 by 6 line is readable Now step 5 writing final prescription After binocular defogging the leftover plus power will be added to the spherical power of the monocular acceptance power So over monocular acceptance after defogging we have in right eye monocular acceptance and leftover plus 1 diopter and in left eye monocular acceptance and leftover plus 0.5 diopter So final power after binocular balancing will be in right eye monocular acceptance was minus 3 if we add the leftover plus 1 diopter then the final power become minus 2 and in the left eye monocular acceptance was minus 2.75 diopter and if we add leftover plus 0.5 diopter then final power will be minus 2.25 diopter so in right eye there was a over correction of minus 1 and in left eye there was over correction of minus 0.5 diopter and when we over correct in myopic patient the rays focus behind the retina and when we see any object the accommodation gets stimulated and bring back the rays into the retina using extra effort of accommodation due to which this patient will develop asthenic symptoms due to over use of accommodation that's why binocular balancing is very important while doing refraction stay with smart optometry and study optometry smartly